blows like a beast. Hey guys, welcome to the show. Today we're checking out the Ego 56 Volt. This is Select Cut, just came out six months ago. It's a beast, 21 inches. It says power beyond belief. Well, what? we're gonna need that power need because that. On, on our back lawn, the front lawn, that's, that's okay. Even the Ryobi handles that one. But the back lawn, the DeWalt, the Ryobi, they only last 10 minutes battery life. They really struggle on this piece of set. And I gotta always put it on the maximum height. So power beyond belief. Do you think it'll work? I hope it will work. Gosh, because I am so bored of it always chugging up. <sighs> I think we should unbox this baby. Enough to unbox. Surprisingly, I've already taken out the battery. Look how big it is. Yeah. This is the battery and charger. It took just under an hour to charge this beast. 7.5 amps. This is the most amount of watts we've had in a lawnmower. Obviously, it's nothing compared to our neighbors. They have ride-alongs. Petrol, gasoline, can it's electric, fit the bill. What do you think of this battery? I think it's, well, it's heavy. It kind of reminds me of like a jetpack battery. Oh, you cool. put it on your back and you fly away. That's what it looks like to me. Yes, this is for the catcher, the manuals, the actual catcher. Press this button and lift it up. Oh la la. Oh, yeah. It's locked into that gear. Nice. You know, the thing about this is that I like is, unlike our previous little mowers, you don't actually have to screw anything in. This one's already screwed in or for you. Battery's in. All right, so this is the key over here, and you have to put the key in, and basically the key is there for security purposes. So the key slots into the side over here, and voila. Ready? Yes. Should we put it on the lawn? Yes. Okay, let's do it. We also need a stopwatch because I want to see how long this battery lasts. Okay. Least, I want it to last at least, at least half an hour. Okay. It's all the marketing. I Let's want it at least it. half an hour. It Let's says an hour. do it. To get it open. Okay, that's locked in, good height. Now I want to get the catcher on. So. Each of the sides. You get the bit of rubber and you put it around the frame. That's ready. So I guess inside there, there should be a mulching plug. Take that out. With this on, it just cuts the grass and leaves it there for it to go into your pool. Then you have to clean up the pool. And uh, we're just gonna bag it. Mulching is good though for germinating the sperm, the seeds, the grass. <laughs> Letting life. Be livable. Show me how you plug that on. Oh yeah, just, this one's pretty easy actually. You just got like that. That seems to slot into place. Very well aligned. And now we're ready. Oh, feels like a beast. I've got to say one thing about lawn mowers is that they really help you with your glutes. I literally have developed a bubble butt just because of lawn mowing. I have to say, pushing it without any self propelling mode is a bit tough, but the first thing we're going to do before we get started is to crank it up to the highest level. And this is, oh, I'm going to say that is a bit firm. Number seven. All right, to get it started, we're going to press down at the middle button and pull up the. As you can see, level seven does not cut my grass. And my first impression is, pushing it is actually relatively easy. And I'm not even using the self-propelling function yet. So let's see how it goes with a lower down level. Take it down to number six and see if it actually starts to cut the grass now. Okay, so noise. It's got like this nice whirring noise. It sounds like it's gonna do some damage. And again, level six didn't really cut any of my grass. So I'm gonna take it down another notch and go for number five. Okay, that's 
looking tidier. You can see on level five, it's handled it really nicely. You can see the grass is ever so slightly just shorter than what it is over here. But I think we can do better. We can go to level four. It's making a funny noise. I might just restart it again and see if I've pressed it down right. Going up the hill manually is definitely some booty building exercise. Now I've got to say, ever since I've been manually doing the lawn mowing, I have managed to gain some good booty gains. But the good thing about this, well, apparently the good thing about this is that it does have a self propellant action. So I'm going to try that now up the hill and see if it has any difference. And the way that we do it is pressed by these buns over here. about the self-propellant I'm not sure it's doing what it should be doing now the reason why she struggled with self-propelling mode is because it was actually turned off this is the, oh. the speed indicator so this nothing will happen put it forward yeah. you can't really move it to the side while it's propelling you can put a bit of tension but it doesn't work that way but propelling you press button there it goes forward and you make it go faster that's that now we saw it was it was working with level four there was a moment where it was making a funny sound on level four over there but i guess once you restarted it it did sound all right and it was cutting i'm gonna go to level three never in the history of the world have we managed to do level three on this grass but If you do try starting it when it's on the base, sometimes it won't start properly. So the best is always to levitate it a little bit. I'll try it one more time. I'm stopping right there. I'm impressed. It hasn't chugged out and there is a noticeable difference. So I'm going to go level two. I'm doing it. Oh I, want it I want it to fail. I'm gonna destroy the ego for my ego. Power beyond belief. Well, I want that. Level two. Level two is very, very hard to push. So I'm gonna try out the self propelling feature, see if that aids me. We're going to stop. Yeah, it failed. Failed on this hilly area. It just couldn't handle level two. I'll give it one more shot. There you go. Failed again. Level two. Power beyond belief. I'll try level three. See how that goes. Now I'm excited to use self-propelling mode going up. Look at that. Look at that. over I want female power to take over with the power of self propelling mode and let me know how it cuts now level three I gotta say it's very very hard to push so it did cut out on level two around here but so far level three it seemed to have rocked the boat and and for level three level two to start it up you need to get the engine at full power so you need to always pull it push it down so it's raised above the bed 
and then you can push it into the bed. Whereas if you try to start it on the bed, it's not gonna get full speed. I personally don't cut that low, but I'll just let you guys know. I wanna try level one eventually, but yeah. Good luck getting up that hill. <laughs> oh God, <laughs> give me the hard stuff to do, thanks. <laughs> I mean, pushing this is, it's doable. <laughs> but it's just awkward, kind of like American Ninja style. Here we go. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna try it with it on and with self propellant. Let me try it with just propellant now. Oh, that is so nice. So that's really good. The good thing about self propellant is you can really help yourself get out of sticky situations like that. So that's really easy. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and just start lawn mowing and see how long it lasts. For. control of it then. <laughs> it does go a little bit too fast sometimes. All right, let's get back down the hill. It's gonna be a breeze. Um, why do you go so fast when you're self-propelling? I don't want to see what they're doing on the TV. Okay, you want it to go <laughs> fast. tip because obviously I'm a rookie in this when you are when you've stopped lawn mowing make sure you take your hand off the self propellant action otherwise <laughs> you do what I do oh do, do it manually booty gains booty gains look lift it up oh it's a beast you know what it looks it looks easier than it actually is to move okay my turn yeah yes yeah let's finish it trust that to check it up <laughs> I am still on level three. It's not how low I cut that circle of power. Magic mushroom. Shall I? Yeah, go for it. Level six. Level three. Level. Done. Level three. Kill the mushrooms. They get clumped up. Oh. 
failed again. Okay, so it seems to struggle clumping. It's level three. I personally don't like cutting this low. But I'll do it just for this review. propelling off I do still like cutting manually because I feel like you get more of a workout but I do also like self pelling but on maximum mode because you get a bit of a, a jog going so I feel like you're working out either way and it does help you when you get stuck I can't believe how low it cut it's this really round. good isn't it it's the lowest I've ever had it cut wow it's doing well I'd say it's almost done and the charge is how much all right so how long have we been using it for still got 50 uh, 20 minutes yeah been using about 20 minutes still got 50 percent yeah, I'm happy with that so far. It's almost done, the guy. It is expensive. It's not power beyond belief, but it is a beautiful belief of power. That's why I say select cut, 200 inches. We still haven't even showed the LED lights. Look, you got lights in the front. They turn off for some reason. More in the dark. I'll go in the shade and show you. Pelling mode is addictive. There you go, look at the lights. What are the lights? Wait, I actually really like this. I'm surprised about the battery. You know, we've managed to actually do the garden pretty much almost about 80% there. We have to nip out now, so we have to do the rest later. But so far, so good. It's got 50% battery. Ooh. 50% battery life left. You can have your booty gains workout, or if you're feeling lazy, you can just go self propellant. So overall, I'm quite chuffed with this. I think it was worth it. I think it was worth, well, you know what let me just hold my reservations for now but so far i'm liking it level three we've never actually been able to cut the grass level three usually it's like level five or six so that's pretty good yeah the DeWalt, it could only do level six like we tried any lower than that it kept on chugging up no all right cool so there you have it guys let us know what you think about the ego select cut lawnmower and drop a slide in the comment section below yeah i like it bye <laughs>
just finished our pal. Our pal. It's completely our pal. So officially, it's meant to leave you with enough charge to go home. But it's just blinking red. So I'm gonna have to, yeah. I'm gonna have to push it. Oh, there it is. Oh, it does. It does give you a little bit of juice so you can still push it home or drive it home. <laughs>